Drone footage shows Ukrainian forces from the 21st Sarmat Battalion assaulting Wagner Hill trenches during Ukraine's Bakhmut offensive. The assault was conducted by a Ukrainian infantry squad that was supported by a tank and a BMP fighting vehicle effectively suppressing the Russian fighters. In general, Ukrainian forces sent in their tank first to suppress the Russian fighters inside their trenches so that the Infantry fighting vehicle carrying the infantry for the assault can safely move towards the position and dismount. When the infantry dismounts, the infantry fighting vehicle also then provides covering fire to further suppress the enemy and setting the conditions for the infantry to safely maneuver around and to close in on the enemy to destroy them. Depending on the situation, the infantry fighting vehicle then can fall back a bit to provide overwatch and further covering fire from a distance or the vehicle can stay with the infantry and directly support them from up close. Well, there are pretty good video examples of boot ways being successful. So I wouldn't say that there's exactly just one way to do it. Of course, there's the Western doctrine and the Eastern doctrine and unique doctrine, but like things are fluent, be like water, my friend. That's what I always say. Of course, it is good to have some kind of guidance via doctrine, but you have to adapt in certain situations. That's it for the video, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day. Please leave a like and comment. It always helps because of the algorithm. A few days ago, YouTube started to less and less recommend my videos to viewers, especially my subscribers. Like I have so much subscribers, but the actual amount of subscribers watching my videos is pretty low especially on content like this and that's exactly the content people subscribe for so that's pretty strange